there everybody. Today I'm going to go over a few key facts as to why you should get Indian runner ducks. Indian runner ducks are unique bottle shaped standing birds. These ducks are so unique that actually there is one runner duck that you may recognize. I'll point out a few things that you need to know about Indian runner ducks in a separate video. So subscribe and click notify so you don't miss that video or any of our next ones. People normally get ducks for either meat or eggs. And according to Indian runner ducks by Pauline Patterson, these birds can lay up to 150 to 200 eggs a year and are very meaty for their size. See how small they are compared to Bunky at four years old? As for us, we get them for foraging to prevent bugs in mom and dad's vineyard. If you've been following us, you should know that mom and dad have a vineyard that they grow grapes to make wine and vinegar. See all the vinegars? And ever since they went into the vineyard, we've had so many fewer slugs, snails, ticks, and other pests. They're so helpful and so good for our grapes and wine vinegar. <laughs> However, we have had to put them in chicken tractors when the grapes are really ripe to prevent them from eating all of our grapes. These birds are great foragers and are fully grown and ready to forage in a few short months. You're not quite there yet. They also come in a large variety of different colors. Seen here, there's white, black, silver, pencil, fawn, and white chocolate, and a few other ones. Unfortunately, our chocolate colored duck, Hershey, has gotten pretty old now and is mostly white. Another great reason to get runners is that they are very social, flightless, black, black, black. The same old black. And, gen and generally quite harmless. <laughs> <laughs> we got these birds when Bunky was very small. So we wanted good, safe family pets. This makes them perfect for young children. And they are very entertaining. Little children love to watch them dance. And honestly, so do I. Not to mention their complex pecking order, meaning the duck in charge goes in front, the duck that nobody likes but still kind of wants to fit in goes in back, and then there's a couple other ducks like Hershey, for example, who just wander over that way. <laughs> well, most ducks have ridiculous loud quacking noises that can wake you up with a heart attack, Indian runner ducks have quiet noises. Females have a loud quack, but are still considered quiet for ducks. But males have a strange hissing sound. Kinda like <laughs> Very funny. Let's all laugh at the duck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. These ducks were bred in, in the East Indies on the Indonesian island of Java to help prevent pesticide in rice fields. The ducks won't eat the rice while it's growing, but are happy to feast on it once it's picked, ripe, and in a basket. <laughs> well, I hope this has inspired you to buy these wonderful birds. We've had these ducks for a few years now, and they're really friendly. They were the first animals other than dogs on our farm. And they're really friendly, they're just great. Whether you want them to help you with pests in your garden, or just as a family pet, there's no denying that these guys are great. Thank you. I'm proud to sit, oh, we forgot to grab the book. The book. <laughs> the book. Crazy. These birds can lay up to 150 to 200 eggs a day, a year. And are, cut. Just keep going. <laughs> it's like 100 eggs a day. 200. 200 Thank eggs you a day. so much, and God bless.